Hello, I'm Nachinator, and today I'm going to show you how to build two designs for a sugarcane farm. Now, the first thing you're going to need is to get everything in my inventory in this lower slot. You can change the glass for any building block you as long as it's a block that you can't walk through. Other than that, it should be pretty much it for the basic design. The items in the top of my inventory were for a more advanced design that I'll show you later. So the first thing we're going to want is just a little hole, and we can place water, sugar cane, and then we're going to have a chest, if my random tick speed turned up high. We're going to have a chest with a hopper on top, and then we can go ahead and put glass around it. I accidentally made that hole too small. We can put glass around it. This will prevent the sugar cane from flying away and not actually getting collected. And then, we don't want to fill in that water because then the sugar cane would break. But we want to do this. And then, last few steps, if your sugar cane grows, you're going to need to break it. We want the um, piston there, the observer there, and then you're going to need a block one block other than grass to go right here with a piece of redstone. Now, if it's grown up because I have my random tick speed set up high, go ahead and break it. And every time that the sugar cane gets all the way to the top, the piston will go off. Now, like I said, this is not the most effective farm, as some of it will, like there, some of it will drop on the back and not actually get collected. But it's a very basic, very cheap farm once you've been to the nether. Now, if you have more resources, then there's a more advanced design we can make. We're going to leave the back intact. It's going to look just like that. We're going to go down one more block, and we're going to take the two items up here. A minecart with a hopper, and any kind of reel other than a detector reel. We're going to have to dig around just so we can place this correctly. You want your chest, your hopper, your rail, and then your hopper with a minecart. And then if you want, you can build this back in. Then you're gonna, of course, if you broke it, want to replace the glass. And then, every time this goes off, it will be collected through the block with a hopper minecart. That's what hopper minecarts are useful for. And to the chest below. And that is a fully automatic sugar cane. Now if you'd like to expand this farm so that it's bigger, and you can place a second piston. You just extend everything back one block. And then you can also just break the water. You can plant sugarcane right next to it, just fine. So even if it's filling water, it doesn't matter. And then every time one of them grows, it'll harvest both of them. And you can expand this however far you want, and this works for the smaller farm too. That's it. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.